Welcome everyone. Today we're going to focus on uh, evaluating expressions. So from the last video you know uh, that expression is um, made with uh, terms and math operations and term is made with uh, letters and numbers. Okay, And you know all the keywords uh, for letters, numbers operations okay uh, so in here we have uh, 5 multiplied by f plus 2 multiplied by y in here 6 multiplied by z divided by 2 multiplied by uh, x and in here s take away 6 multiplied or times d okay so let's start with the first question so in this question, we are ask, asked to find the value of following uh, terms or expressions if we know that x equals 2, okay? So we need to find the value of each of the following. Let's start with the first one for x. So we need to know our rules. So for x means we need to multiply 4 by x. And if we know that x equals 2, instead of x, we need to write down 2. Okay, so that gives us 4 multiplied by 2. And 4 multiplied by 2 is x. Okay, so 4x equals 8 if, two, if x equals 2. The next uh, expression is 3x plus 5. And 3x means 3 times x. So now again, x is 2. So 3. And we can uh, write down in the brackets. Multiplied by 2 plus 5. So the first step is rewrite uh, the expression okay the same expression but instead of the letter write down the number so 3 multiplied by 2 plus 5 so this is the first step use numbers instead of letters okay now we need to uh, evaluate it so using BIMDAS find the value of it okay so remember this is multiplication this is addition what's first uh, so in our um, order of operations we know that multiplication is first so let's write it down 3 times 2 is 6 plus 5 equals 11 okay the next one and here we have x to the power of 3 and um, in the other words it's x cubed okay so what does it mean again you've met that before so x to the power of 3 means we need to multiply x by itself three times so this little 3 means we need to multiply the base and the base is x three times by itself okay now we know that x equals 2 so the next step is just instead of letter write down the number so we have 2 by 2 by 2 so 2 by 2 is 4 and 4 by 2 is 8 okay and the last one in here we have x squared or x to the power of 2 minus 3 multiplied by x plus 5 so uh, again the first step instead of letters use numbers and we know that x squared means x multiplied by x okay so let's start we have 2 to the power of 2 so 2 multiplied by 2 
minus. So every single time we need to follow uh, the expression, okay? So we have minus in here, so minus 3x. So 3 multiplied by 2 and plus 5. Now our uh, first step is done. The next step is look at uh, order the operations, look at BIMDAS and state what to first, okay? So we know that multiplication is first. It's uh, really good and helpful when you underline um, what to do first, okay? So 2 multiplied by 2 is 4 and follow uh, the expression as well. Minus 3 multiplied by 2 6 and plus 5, okay? Now, um, 4 minus 6 plus 5 this is first. Minus and plus are on the same level in our pyramid and they equally important, okay? So don't do addition first if um, subtraction, subtraction is first, okay? So 4 minus 6 is minus 2 plus 5 and minus 2 plus 5 is 3. Take it down into your copies, please. Okay, so we have the next question, question number two. And in this case, we have uh, two letters. So we know that A equals minus two and B equals four. And now we need to find the value of the uh, following. And before we start, we need to just remember a few more rules. When we have uh, Two positive numbers and we want to multiply them of course the answer is positive but if the two numbers are negative uh, the answer is positive if they have different signs so if one is negative and the other is positive the answer is negative or the first one is positive and the other is negative the answer is negative okay so bear in mind when we multiply two numbers and they have the same sign, so both of them are positive or both of them are negative, the answer is positive. And uh, if we are multiplying two numbers and they have different signs, so one is negative, the other one is positive, the answer is always negative. Okay, so this is another thing to take down into your copies in color and another thing to remember it. Okay. So let's start with the first question and the first one is minus 2 AB. So minus 2 multiplied by A multiplied by B. So first step is writing it down again but instead of letters we need to put numbers, okay? So we have minus 2 multiplied by a and a is minus 2 multiplied by b and b is 4 okay so minus 2 multiplied by minus 2 and looking in here minus multiplied by 9 minus the answer is positive so we have 4 and 4 multiplied by 4 is 16 okay the next question in here so we have 3ab squared so 3 multiplied by a multiplied by b squared and b squared is b multiplied by b so again b squared is b multiplied by b okay first step instead of letters write down the numbers okay so we have 3 multiplied by a and a is minus 2 and b squared so uh, b equals 4 so 4 to the power of 2 okay we know that um, in our order of operations uh, powers are first okay so let's write down 3 multiplied by minus 2 again and 4 squared means 4 multiplied by 4 not 4 multiplied by 2 what is common mistake so 4 multiplied by 4 is 16 
okay? So um, 3 multiplied by minus 2, if we uh, are looking in here, so we have positive multiplied by negative what is negative, so 3 multiplied by minus 2 is negative 6, so minus 6, and minus 6 multiplied by 16 is minus 96, okay? The next one, um, a to the power of 3, or a cubed, minus a b, minus a multiplied by b. Okay, so let's start with the first step. So we have a to the power of 3, so minus 2 to the power of 3, minus, minus 2 multiplied by 4. So as you can see, uh, we need to follow an uh, expression every single time. So this is our a cubed minus minus and a b is in here. a multiplied by b, okay? So minus 2 multiplied by 4. Now, um, remember, remember our uh, beam does. So uh, powers first, then multiplication and minus is the last thing we'll do. Okay, so minus 2 to the power of 3. So minus 2 to the power of 3 is minus 2 multiplied by minus 2 and multiplied by minus 2. So negative by negative is positive and positive by negative is negative. Okay, we have 3 minuses, that means um, the answer is negative. So minus and then Mm, 2 by 2 is 4 and by 2 is 8. So minus 8, then following our expression we have minus and then minus 2 multiplied by 4 and the answer is always uh, negative when one of them is negative. So minus 2 multiplied by 4 is minus 8. In the bracket minus 8, okay? Equals. So um, Next thing to remember, if we have minus and minus just beside each other, each other that means we can um, just simply write it down as a plus in here. So we have minus 8 plus 8, what is 0. Okay? And the last question here, it might be... Um, complicated, but uh, when we break it down, it's it's not too bad. So first of all, let's start with the top, then we'll do the bottom, okay? So equals, instead of letters, we need to write down the numbers, okay? So B is 4, so we have 4 minus a, and a is minus 2, so let's put it in the bracket, okay? So this is b minus a, then all over 3a plus b, so 3 multiplied by a, and a is minus 2, and plus b, what is 4, okay, equals. So let's do the top expression first and then we'll do the bottom, okay? Okay, so the top is 4 minus minus 2 and as we know when we have two minuses just beside each other and that means we can just simply write down 4 plus 2, what is 6, okay, done. This is the top number. Now let's do the bottom one. And the bottom is 3 multiplied by minus 2 plus 4 equals. So we have multiplication in here and addition. Uh, looking back at our uh, beam dust rule, we know that multiplication is first. So 3 multiplied by minus 2. And then looking in here, uh, positive by negative is negative. So it's negative 6. 
plus 4 and this is minus 2 and minus 2 is the bottom number okay and looking back at, back at our um, expression in here we have 6 all over all over minus 2 so 6 all over minus 2 and the same uh, we have division in here this line means divide by so uh, the rules for dividing are the same uh, as for multiplication okay so if one number is positive the other one is negative the answer is negative so equals minus and 6 divided by 2 is 3 so the answer is minus Done. Okay, so take it down into your copies, please. So, uh, summarizing our video today, you need to be able to evaluate an expression if the value of the variables, uh, so the value of the letters, are given. If we know what is x, what is uh, y or a, b, we need to find the value of the uh, the expression. Okay, so I'll see you tomorrow.